Are you thinking of moving to Minnesota? Because I have 10 reasons why you should. And stay tuned to the end for a bonus offer. For those that don't know me, I'm Twin Cities Realtor Shannon Cola, and I'm all about creating better futures through real estate. Now let's get into those 10 reasons. Number one, we are the land of 10,000 lakes. This means you are never very far from a lake. So for swimming or fishing, we also just have this huge boating culture here. And with all that shoreline, it lends itself to some beautiful lakefront properties. But the lakes are not just used in the summer. Ice fishing is also a really popular lake activity here. Number two on the list is job availability. Minnesota is home to many Fortune 500 companies, such as Target, Best Buy, United Health Group, US Bank, 3M, and General Mills, all offering a huge range of industries to be a part of. Another job source that moves us into number three on the list is universities. There are 93 colleges and universities in Minnesota some of which rank nationally, such as Carleton College, McAllister College, St. Olaf College, and my alma mater, the University of Minnesota Twin Cities. Number four is amazing restaurants and a top-notch brewery scene. Esquire actually called Minneapolis America's most intriguing food and drink city that no one's talking about. Okay, several Twin City chefs and restaurants have won James Beard Awards, and they all offer different fare from all around the world. But I do want to touch on the fact that there are more than 175 breweries that operate in Minnesota, with some of the bigger names being Surly Brewing Company, Summit Brewing Company, and Fulton Brewery. Number five on the list of why you would love moving to Minnesota is the cost of living. Now, cost of living in the Twin Cities is slightly above the national average, but compared to other major metro areas, the Twin City is still quite affordable. There is also a huge range of options from being directly in the cities to being in one of the many developing cities just outside the cities. I mean, Chanhassen was recently named the best place to live in America by Money Magazine. Or you can always head north for more of a woodsy feel, or you can head south for more of a farmland feel. Number six on my list is the sports teams. Minnesota has six professional sports teams with great venues from Target Field, XL, to US Bank, to Target Center and the Allianz Field. Many a Minnesotan also cheer on the Minnesota Gophers, which is a part of the oldest major college conference still running, the Big Ten. Whether you're a football fan or a basketball enthusiast, maybe you're a baseball diehard, there is definitely something for you. With Minnesota being the state of hockey, you will hear about the Minnesota Wild. Number seven is well-preserved architecture. Summit Avenue in St. Paul stands alone as the country's best preserved avenue in 19th century buildings. And then the Basilica of St. Mary is recognized as one of the finest examples of Beaux Arts architecture in the country, and it was built around 1910. Number eight is the art scenes. From our music venues like First Ave, which is celebrated as one of the longest running independently owned and operated venues in the US, to our theaters, such as the Guthrie and the Ordway. But what I love is that there are a ton of small yet brilliant theaters to choose from, like a Brave New Workshop. Then there are museums. From the Minneapolis Institute of Art to the Walker Art Center, I mean, I am constantly meeting friends to walk around the sculpture gardens. It is probably one of my favorite places to be. Number nine is the people. As the saying goes, we are Minnesota nice. Now, of course, all people are individuals, but in general, the people of Minnesota will give you a wave or say hello, even if you are strangers as you pass each other on the street. They are willing to help you find your way or bring you a hot dish for pretty much any occasion. I know, I know, everyone else calls it a casserole, but here in MN, we say hot dish. And then number 10 on why you will love Minnesota is you get four seasons. Now I will say the Minnesota winters are not for everyone, but what is enchanting is seeing all the leaves turn into this brilliant, fiery spectacle in the fall. And then you survive through the winter. Now let's be clear, there are many a Minnesotan that winter is their favorite season, from the ice skating to the cross country skiing to cuddling up by the fire. And then there's something just magical about looking outside after a fresh snowfall. Then this emergence happens, okay? As you see the trees start to bud and there's this new freshness to everything and everybody starts to creep back outside. And then summer hits and we grab our swimsuits and we hit the lakes. So if you are thinking of moving here, please ask any questions in the comments below. I will be sure to personally respond. And that bonus I mentioned, will look in that description below for a fantastic relocation guide. 
If you need to reach me, my contact info is also in that description below. Otherwise, check out this next video on eight ways to spend your Saturday night in Minneapolis.